Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, Jericho, welcome, buddy. Labsy, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, buddy. Haven't spoke to you in a while, so I hope you're doing well. I'm going well, long time no see. Looks good as well, looks scary. Ah, uh, it is a bit of a scary game, bit of a puzzle scary game, guys. Um, today, guys, we're playing a new release game. It's released this coming Friday. Um, today being, what's the date today? I have no idea. You know, the 11th, the 11th Wednesday, uh, January 2023. So this game gets released on the 13th of um, January 2023. It's brought to me today by the amazing people. Yes, those amazing people at Rattalicker Games, rattalickergames.com. Check them out. It's called Chasing Static. Now, this game's been released, uh, Rattalicker Games, um, oh, Labs, this is a love a cheeky puzzle. Um, just a quick question, guys, Labsy or Jericho. Uh, does everything sound okay? I had a bit of technical issues yesterday with the stream. It was really um, a bit a bit wonky. My sound in the background was all choppy and stuff like that. But do I sound, does everything sound perfect today? I'm just asking you guys. If you could let me know, I'd be really appreciative of that. Thank you, Labs. Thank you, my dear friend. Um, yeah, this game's been released by Rattle League Games before, but only on, um, on PC. And this coming Friday gets released for consoles. So you PC players out there got the game before us consoles gamers. So you know what the game's about. But I've been looking forward to this game. I was hoping it'll get a console release and it's finally coming and we finally have it right now. So I'm streaming it for all my fabulous viewers out there. So if you're watching me live right now on my Twitch channel, please feel free to hit that heart icon and drop me a follow. Do appreciate it. Uh, but if you're watching this back on my uh, YouTube channel as a video replay, like it, hit that like button guys. Come on, show some love. Uh, comment, I will reply to your comments if need be. And remember, it's free, F R W. -E. And if you love a horror game, guys, or a bit of a puzzle game, a bit of a creepy game, smash that subscription button. It is free, F R W. -E. It takes one second, one click of your time. So I want to say thank you for streaming this game and all the other sponsored games out there that I've been uh, streaming for you guys. Just all you through subscribe to my channel. It's the best way of saying thank you. Help my channel grow. It hasn't got many uh, subs at the moment, but as I keep saying, if it, the more the merrier. I really do appreciate it all. It makes me feel good. It makes me want to bring more content to everyone. So come visit me over on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube. That's Marbrelay, M-A-R-B-R-O-L-A-Y. Uh, Lapsy, if you just go to uh, whatever console you want to buy it on, so if you want to buy it on the PlayStation or Xbox, go to your, uh, your your PlayStation store or Xbox store, and it will give you a price. I can't, I can't tell you how much it's going to cost because, one, I got the game for free. <laughs> I'm sorry. And two... Um, in Australia here, our prices would differ to over there in uh, England. And obviously people in America and Japan and everywhere else that's watching me. Okay, let me tell you what the game's about before we, before we even start. Chasing static. In the dead of night, a fierce storm rages across North Wales, miles from any town. Chris Seawood seeks refuge in a remote roadside cafe. Shortly thereafter, Chris experienced a horrific sight as he finds the cafe waitress pinned to the ceiling by something with a fierce, glowing eyes. He passes out, waking up in a dusty old abandoned remains of a cafe. Uh, inspired by 80s sci-fi horror, and man, that's getting really bad in the uh, Inspired by 80s sci-fi horror and complementary surreal cinema, Chasing Static delivers a unique take on a narrative adventure gene through new audio-driven gameplay mechanics and non-linear exploration. Uh, the game features sonic exploration, uh, audio-driven gameplay mechanics have you, have you hunting uh, anomalies with experimental frequencies and displanted monitor device. Uh, Lo-fi, hi-fi, crunching, low, poly visuals, resemblance of classic with full voice acting. That's a good start. Love full voice, uh, full voice acting. High quality sound and design and modern approach to gameplay. Uh, not linear really gameplay. Explore the world of chasing static on your own pace and cover its secrets in any order you please. Uh, the game is available for the Nintendo Switch, the PS4, the PS5. Of the Xbox One, Xbox Series S and X. Today, guys, I am playing on the Xbox Series X uh, using the Xbox wireless headset and a Xbox Series X limited edition AquaShift controller. Uh, Labsy says, I don't think it's in the store yet. I can't see it. As I said, uh, Labsy gets released the 13th of, uh, uh, 13th of January. So Friday for us, two days from here, three days for you. Um, Mikey says, I need to turn my mic up. 
Welcome, cowboy. Welcome, welcome. Is none of that crappy sound going, cowboy? Okay, just turn the mic up. Not yet, mate. Oh, thanks, cowboy. Thanks. Let's have a look at the options. I made a bit of a best breath today, guys. I don't know why. Did some work this morning. Came back and sat down to um do a stream, and I've kind of a bit out of breath. I, I do apologize if I'm, I'm sounding a bit puffed. So, yeah, you're going to have to bear with me. I'm a bit, yeah. I had a, there was a whole family pie sitting in my fridge, and I thought I'll eat that. <laughs> so I cooked it up. And I ate the whole thing. That's probably why I'm out of breath. I feel stuffed. Uh, Labzi says, you played Red Dead Redemption 2 much? Yeah, I finished it, Labzi. I finished it on the Xbox, buddy. Oh, I played it a couple of weeks ago as well on the Xbox. Just for a bit of fun. The Xbox Series X, that is. Um, just for a bit of fun. <coughs> Pardon me, guys. <laughs> Let's get into the game. Red Lucky Games presents. Oh. Chasing static. Sorry, really out of puff. It is amazing. Amazing game, Lazzie. Yeah, it's inspired by the... If um, I was reading what the game Excuse is about, Cowboys inspired by like the Chris, 80s I style presume. horror and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, sure. It's Evelyn. And I wouldn't laugh at... Um, we spoke on so the phone. So I won't talk it. Oh, right, sorry. I didn't recognize your voice. Oh, that's fine. I'm happy you could make it. Your father, it seems he... Well, he didn't have a lot of friends. In the end. He never did. Right. Anyway, the Hall asked me to give you this. It was all they had in regards to his personal effects. A book? Huh. I'm sure there's a lot you have to process today. I apologize for being so forward. No, it's, it's fine. Honestly, um, we really weren't that close. I'll reply to the chats in a second, well, guys. He's listening to this. I'm sorry for your loss, Chris. I hope you have a safe journey home. Evelyn. I think a nice name. Who is Evelyn? Isn't Evelyn of Resident Evil Village? <clears throat> okay, let's just pause it up for a second. I'll just reply to the, uh, the comments on the Twitch live chat right now. Uh, Cowboy says, looks like a PS1 game. Well, Cowboy, I wouldn't laugh at that, buddy, because PS1 horror games are still yet the best horror games made. Like Resident Evil, Silent Hill, and they've kind of like remade them. And yes, they look prettier. They're kind of scarier, but those horror games back in those days, the survival horror, you can't beat them, man. You just can't. You can't beat them. So the more the merrier, if they can start bringing out more games like that and it's still with the tank controllers maybe and maybe not the tank controllers where you can just turn them on and off if you please, but the same visuals, oh, man, just brings back the old memories. Uh, Labzi says, it almost made me cry. Labzi, have you played Red Dead, Red Dead Redemption 1, the first one, buddy? Because if you haven't played the first one, you played the first one after the second one. So the Red Dead Redemption 2 is a prequel to the first one, as you probably know when you finished it. <clears throat> so now you're going to play number one. Number one's amazing. It's also got the nightmare version too. He's got all the zombies. In. <clears throat> Pardon me, guys. <clears throat> I'm trying to not bring up any of that pie that I had for um, a bit of our brunch. A bit of breakfast and lunch. Okay, now we're going to figure out what we're doing. What's this? To whom it may concern. Uh, by the way, Cowboy, I've got a visual novel coming tomorrow, the 12th, which is Thursday, by um, another one of my sponsors. Yeah, Labsy, I suggest you play Red Dead Redemption 1 then, because it's amazing. It really is amazing. M most people think that Red Dead Redemption 1 is better than 2. Man, this is taking ages to load, isn't it? Okay. I think it might have crashed, guys. <laughs> Good start. Good start. 
Okay, so as I said, this game does get released this coming Friday, so maybe there's a bit of um, a bug in it where it just doesn't load. But it looks like it's crashed. What's that, Cowboy? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the game's crashed, guys. Start it over again. Okay, that was great. The game crashed. Straight off the bat, the game has crashed. <clears throat> kind of weird. Hopefully it doesn't crash again. Let's skip all this stuff if we can. Good way to start the stream. Get into the we're in the car to start with. We'll get our notebook. As soon as we get our notebook, the game just crashes. Great. Great start. Okay, so we're now into the game, but then now the game is not loading at all. Wow. Okay, so I have no idea what's going on. I'm going to give it another shot. Still with me? So this is the third time lucky we're starting the game. It just keeps crashing. Or freezing up, I'm not too sure. It just doesn't go any further. Well, we've got a certain part, but now I'm really, we're really worried. Like when I'm playing now, how long it's going to go for? You guys, Labsy Cowboy Jericho, are you still guys with me at the moment, or am I? Uh, have I lost you guys? Have I lost anyone? Is anyone watching the stream live right now? Yeah, I don't know what's going on, but the game just keeps crashing, Cowboy. It just doesn't want to load. Like I get, to, I got to that car part. I didn't even get the second time around. I didn't even get to the car part. Okay, we're back into it. So hopefully this time, she works. <coughs> Where's the rattling man when you need him? To let him know the game's crashing like hell. Now what, let's see if I can skip some of this stuff. No. Hopefully I can skip their um, the, the, the voicing. I'm, I'm really worried Excuse it's going to crash me. again, eh? Uh, okay, we skip this stuff. You're fine. Because we've already heard it the first time right. around. I do apologize, guys. Anyway. <laughs> wow. I'm sure. No, it... Oh, well. man. I hope you have a safe... Okay, so hopefully now we play. Fingers crossed. Okay, so we're in the car. So last time we were in the car, we picked up the notebook. I'm scared of picking up the notebook again because we picked it up last time and what happened? The game just froze. To whom it may concern. Okay, so now it loads and this is where it froze. Ah! Back into now. the pages of this book, you will find my <laughs> life's work. Eye. A means with no end. A fruitless garden. Thirty years of questions with no answers. Yeah, fingers crossed, cowboy. It keeps up. They're all good in the hoods. It's very PlayStation one ish I love it. Love it. Fingers Much crossed like we don't get any more. As soon as I saw that loading thing in the corner, Something and it was just like a few minutes time that didn't load for, I was worried. I only hope that these tattered pages may serve to prove that we are more than ourselves. And that our perception of reality is merely a veil over our own ideals and hunger to understand this world. Okay, Lavzi, thank you for the uh, the lurk, buddy. I have appreciate ya. Many regrets. Good to see you again. The institute is not one of them. Okay, so we can drive the car while looking around. This is amazing. Pick up coffee cup. There's not much more I can do. I was it. Hold it. What's this? Gear stick. Use. <laughs> Have a bit of coffee. Coffee for the cowboy. Okay, so there's nothing else I can touch. I'm just get change gears, maybe. Let's have a look else. 
Okay, the, the camera is. What if I could. Hold it, headlights. Okay, we turn the headlights off. It's bad. Very bad. We, we do take a little radio. There are. This is. Okay, options. I'm just trying to look. The look sensitivity is too fast for me, guys. I do apologize, but I'm not a good one with first person games. I get a bit motion sickness. Okay, so that's much better for me. Much better. Love box. Okay, so roadmap. Take the roadmap. We'll examine it while we're driving in the dead of night when it's raining. And we're just. Okay. Let's get the. F okay, no. No, Cowboy says I don't do coffee. See, Cowboy, the trouble is to try coffee. A weird way of trying coffee. You need to try it. Normal. The guy just shops to have our caramel latte. Make sure you have coffee with milk before you say you don't like it. Good old days for that. I remember going Christmas tree hunting, like going looking for Christmas tree lights using a map. It was good. And now navigation has just taken over. It's no, no fun anymore. No fun anymore. Okay, <clears throat> use a left stick to move. Uh, LT to run. Okay, let's run, let's walk. <clears throat> Pardon me, guys. Okay, so we're in the cafe. Do you want to see what the sign says, if it says anything? Examine, $2.99. Uh, it's pretty cheap for a fryer. Yeah, I remember that, cowboy. <laughs> I remember that. I never did it. But I remember that. And then remember when I first got my first navigational phone? Um, it was a Nokia 8210. And yeah, Nokia 8210, I think it was. And no, no, Nokia maybe 6120 or 6110 or something like that. And, and the navigation on it was called Martin. And Martin took me everywhere. Oh, good old Martin. Couldn't beat him. You could not beat Martin. You couldn't talk to him. But I called him Martin. His name was Mark, because his voice, the voice of his, the character's name was Mark, so that's what he's saying. Christ alive! You almost gave me a heart attack. Let me guess. Got lost in the storm? Uh, Cowboy said, I thought this might be third person. Yeah, at, at the start of it, when you're leaning against the car, it kind you know, of looks like a first person a game. Two-way thing. But... Oh, I forgot to answer. I do apologize. Okay, uh, but no, okay, what's first? Are you still open? It's been a long day. I'm heading east. Sorry to barge in. Uh, you're still open, mate. Uh, third person in like closed, things like this. But we have all the coffee well, ones. Not third person, we like you get to see your character. Like you're from around here. No. I mean, I used to be. A long time ago. Where are you headed anyway? Ah, <laughs> oh, pardon me, guys. Uh, it's been a long day. I'm it's kidding. been Let's a long do it all. day. Honestly, I it's thought been that a long day. Never end. Ten miles of trees and well, more trees. Yeah, it's a killer. We have coffee though. I'm uh, headed east, Oswestry. Oh, so do you want the good news or the bad news first? Uh, uh, let's do bad. Okay, go on. Hit me with the bad news first. Always got to end on a good note. Fearless. I like it. Well, you missed the turning. It's like half an hour back the way you came. <laughs> Crap. Good news is I know the way. We'll be headed that way myself soon anyway. Hang about. Okay, hey, she's uh, trying to pick me up. Bum a lift. Sure. Uh, to be honest, I could do with the company. Wasn't looking forward to cycling in this rain anyway. Nothing creepy though. I'll kick your ass if you try anything. Ah, uh, okay. Hey, she's not looking I'm for a bit of a hanky panky. To be off that road. Where are we anyway? Welcome to the last. Is he wearing a hat? Am I wearing? Is my character wearing a hat? Or is that his fine. hair? I can't figure Don't it out. A lot of customers these days, though. Ah, oh, it's not going to shame me. Super. Oh yeah, help yourself to coffee. I'll be done in five. <sighs> okay, so where's the coffee here? So I never I'll try it, yeah. 
Ah, oh, it's Chris. Chris, right. Nice and simple. Yeah. It was my dad's name. My grandfather too. Okay. My oh, parents were not exactly right ones to you the tip, you know. Thanks though. <laughs> I thought she was gonna try to steal My it. My parents weren't exactly ones to break tradition. Well, it's nice to meet you, Chris. I'm a name. Uh, it might be a beanie. I yeah, I'm not just sure. It might be his hair. Uh, Labzy, but it means winter, the right? way it was kind of like sticking like a brim or a hat. That's why I presume it was a. An era translates to snow. Oh, my Welsh is a little rusty. Hey, I'm impressed. Most English folk can't even read the road signs. Well, neither can I, apparently. So what brings you to this neck of the woods? A list of today's specials? I, um, well, I buried my dad today. Oh, oh shit. That's bad news. I'm sorry. Oh, it's fine. We didn't uh, exactly see eye to eye. Yeah, my dad left when I was six. Turned up ten years later wanting to play Happy Family. <laughs> I still get calls oh, from picture him. Of a coffee. Not that I ever answer. Family, eh? I'll be finished up soon. Then we can hit the road. Where is she? Oh, she just vanished. Oh, no, there she is. Let's see if we can get behind her. Oh, if we get too close to her, maybe she just freak out. Oh, she's busy. I know what Cowboy was thinking there. I know, but she'll get angry if I go behind there. I, I want to do it badly, though. I want to play this radio. The radio looks like it needs to be played with. It looks like I need to do something else because she's been around those tables before. Okay, so... Okay, I'm looking to rob the place, he says. Man, what more do I need to do? Do I just drink more coffee? I don't really drink it, I just kind of hold it. Okay, so I'm sticking around for a bit. Man, she's taking... Oh, maybe she's finished now. No, nah, she's still cleaning. Is there something else I need to do? Oh, man, I think I've seen everything, haven't I? Do I need to get the broom and be Harry Potter for the week? Okay, so maybe far out. She goes back around, starts cleaning again. I'm gonna flip. I've I've looked at everything except for I can't eat these damn cakes, which I'm bummed about. And there's there's obviously something I need to do because she is still hot. Maybe what I do is just grab this coffee. Okay, so now I've got to go over to the coffee machine, maybe. I don't know. Coffee pot. Coffee machine. There we go. Okay, so that's what I needed to do. What an idiot. What an idiot. <laughs> I had to have a coffee. I was going to say, I've picked up the cup, but I haven't done anything with it. God, that took a while, guys. I do apologize. As I said, a little bit slow today. Cowboy, around here, my stream is always amateur hour. You know that. As I said, guys, I ate a whole family-sized pie for brunch. Well, it was between breakfast and lunch. It was a it was a bacon and beef. It was terrible because I thought it was going to be like chunky chunky steak pie. Um, but it turned out to be like mince. And instead of being normal mincemeat, it felt like it was um, someone got mincemeat and chucked the mince in a blender and then minced the mince. So it was like horrible, minute oh, mince. Did you deal with that? But I, Just mess with I the still ate the whole thing. Signal again. And then um, I'm feeling really like crap right now, to be honest. Um, I'm going to play the radio station here. Yeah, puree mince, cowboy. I swear to God, I've, had, I've been to a Chinese restaurant once, right? And I got a special fried rice. And instead of coming out with, you know, rice, it came out with minced rice. It's like they put the rice in a blender in minced and all cut every... Like they cut, it was like couscous. Kind of like that, but it wasn't. It was rice. It was horrible. 
Hey, builders, welcome to the stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yes, once again, builders, this game is brought to me today by the amazing people at Rattalika Games. RattalikaGames.com. It's called Chasing Static. Uh, radio Static again. I don't know if I'm supposed to start getting a radio station. Can't really get anything. You would have thought I would have got something by now. I give up. Okay, got some. Good. Took me like 10 goes. Uh, I can't wait to had some couscous last night. Couscous is the most easiest thing to make, though, I. Eh? Even you can make it, cowboy. <laughs> Roy Hyde from the cowboy. Just drink your damn coffee, he says. What's up, girl? I'm the cowboy. I'm standing right behind you. Hard to get right. Well, Cowboy, if you're a cook like me, buddy, it's never hard to get right. Never hard. Once again, guys, if you haven't seen my cooking Instagram page, oh, let me just post that for you now. That's a bit of a, a bit of a shout out for myself, I do believe. I know I'm here by Cowboy. Check out my cooking, cooking with Marbrelay, guys. Cooked up some yummy food. Uh, a lot of uh, a lot of salmon, a lot of fish getting cooked lately. The cowboy loves his fish. I was, I was thinking, cowboy, of uh, cooking you up something special. It's got to cook up a nice, a big, big fish stuffed with tomatoes and baked in coffee beans. How's that sound for you, cowboy? Not a huge fish fan. What about tomato and coffee, eh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, th I think I've had enough. Oh shit, the powers went out. Okay, so everything's gone dark. Again, that's the second here. time this week. Hold on. I've okay, a bit scary. Here, somewhere. Now, you only like fish when they batter the hell out of it, eh? So it's, 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 the fish is the size of like a. Oh, it's, it's probably like four inches in diameter. But when they bring it onto your plate, it's like 12 inches long because the rest of it is, is damn... Oh, what's this? Sorry. It's just damn batter. I don't like batter. I like it. I like my fish crumbed if I'm going to have it crumbed. See, this is why I love smokers. You wouldn't mind taking a look, would you? Have I ever cooked a John Dory? John Dory from back. the Fear the Walking Dead? Uh, okay, I guess. Last time I was waiting what's, for... What's your go-to fish, it. cowboy? See, builders, we've got him actually liking fish now. Soon it's going to be tomato, and soon we'll be drinking tomato juice with coffee. Now that I didn't know what I was doing, because I was talking too much on the stream, I'd have no idea what I'm doing. Sort of, yep. Sort of the shit out of that, baby. Okay, so... Might be a second, guys. I've got someone knocking at my door. Just bear with me just for a second.
Okay, guys, I'm back. I do apologize that for some nutcase was banging at my door trying to sell me raffle tickets for the church, I think it was. <sighs> yeah, thank you, cowboy. Um, that's where I was headed. It's gonna be, um, uh, gonna be a bit scary, I think, out here. Yeah, this is this is spooky. Kitchen door. So, what am I looking toilet. for here? Kitchen. In the kitchen? Right. Save my money for John Dory. Slap that mother in the face. Hey, <coughs> Nero, a, a bunch of these fuses <coughs> are fried. Should be some spares in there somewhere. Okay, so looking for spares. There's the diagram there, so. There's the kitchen. Man, I'm really out of breath. I shouldn't eat that pie. It's not sitting right. Is there any way we can... We can't really, uh... Duck or nothing like that in this game. It's a bit of a bummer. I'm really feeling crap right now. <laughs> okay, we got a screwdriver. Uh... The builder says, Marbs is the master of tax deduction. One of these alliance who doesn't pay any tax. I've never paid tax in my life. They call me... John Dory. <laughs> Oh, whoops, I've done it again. Okay, so we're going to look for spare fuses. So it should be... It's not going to be the fridge. What's this thing here? It's a bin. Examine the sink. I think I need some washing up. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's going to be in this drawer here. Okay, it's locked. Okay, so we pried it open, we got the fuse. I'm liking this game, eh? I'm gonna get used to using the controllers though. Okay, so there's no use for the fuse here. What? What? Did he say there's n there's no no use for the fuse here? Oh, I'm a bit confused what he said. Dead. Okay, so that's dead. Get rid of that one. Okay, so let's put the new one in. There's no use for the fuse here. What the fuck? That's nah, dead. Okay, so there's. Okay, so how many fuses? Let's have a look at this one. Oh man, I'm, I'm trying to. I'm the trying to get dead. that there. Okay, so we've got four fuses. Let's. Okay, so now we can put a fuse there. Oh man, it's. It's really jerky. I'm trying to light it up. And we haven't got another fuse. So, okay, we're going to find more fuses, do we? Obviously. And I'm feeling absolutely like rubbish right now. That damn pie is not sitting well. Not sitting well. Okay, so there's supposed to be more fuses around. I found one. Okay, come on, give me, give me more fuses. Wouldn't you keep all the fuses together, girl? Lights only is... Okay, so lights only get two at either end. So, okay, let's take them out. Okay, come on. I can't get that second one out. Okay, so got it. Now just put it in the end one. I only needed two. Okay. Hey, uh, no need to thank me or anything. We're right? back, we've got an achievement unlock, guys. Let there be light. It took a while because I didn't read the piece of paper properly. Do apologize. Let's look at the toilet, man. We can just go. Use toilet. It flushes it first. Man. 
I better wash my hands. Unlike the cowboy, never washes his hands when he goes to the toilet. But yeah, you know, you can't win them all. Man, I'm starting to get pains in my chest. This isn't good. I'm feeling like crap. <laughs> and lot just like that, I think the game's frozen again. Man, this this game is just. Yeah, I just had to drink. I, the, the, the pie is just not sitting well, cowboy. So, the game is frozen again. Man, this is rubbish. To be honest, it's, it's pure rubbish. I'll leave it for a little bit in case it comes good. We'll just sit here and talk for a second, guys. I do apologise. I don't. Where's Randlick a man when you need him, mate? Like seriously, it, 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 it just froze every five seconds. This game. Hopefully, they can patch the crap out of this. Okay, so I don't think it's working at all. Once again, guys, if you're watching me live or you're watching this back on my YouTube channel, I really do apologize about this. But as I said, it gets released this coming Friday, so hopefully they fix it before release. Because it's terrible at the moment. The game itself is great, but this, this freezing stuff is terrible. Okay, we're back into it until the fourth time. It's hopefully... The bad thing about it is I don't wonder if the game saved itself. Because I don't yeah, hopefully it just automatically saved. The game is interesting. I'm really, really enjoying it. But gee whiz, does it just freeze up every five seconds? Like every time it goes to a loading part. I think it's frozen again. It makes me feel like I want to just delete the game and reinstall it and see if it works better that way. You know how sometimes when you just download a game and you just delete it and do it again and it works because oh man, it's just it's just this is the fifth time now I'm starting it. Fifth time, guys. Now, yeah, now it's working good. I was going to say, it doesn't want to go past the Rattlelicky logo. Maybe I'll, um, I'll pass it on to Rattlelicky Games that had major issues with it freezing up. And then maybe I might just delete the game and reinstall it and see if it fixes it that way. Because, wow. I remember downloading a, a Game Pass game once before, Cowboy. Never played it. Just downloaded it. The first time I played it, it just would not load at all. It wouldn't even start. It just went to a black screen. So I deleted it, downloaded it again, and it worked per perfectly. So, no idea what's going on there. So, new game. I can't even load a game. And now I think it's frozen again. Well, doesn't this suck, guys? It's just freezing up big time. Oh, man. Doesn't work again. What I'll do is I'll delete it and I'll download it again. We'll, we'll go from there while I'm still streaming. See if this is to bear with me for a second, see if that fixes it. Because it is glitchy as hell. I don't know what's to the go. Okay, so it's not even going past the Rattlelicky screen, screen again. Yeah, it's not very big. So I think I'm, what I'll do is I'll put it on pause at the moment. Put the stream on pause, guys. I'll delete the game, reinstall the game. Come back, see if that fixes it. I'll be back in hopefully very shortly. Bear with me, guys. Bear with me.
Okay, guys, we're back. We just deleted Chase and Static, and now we've reinstalled it. Because we were just we were just finding so many freezing. It froze like six times. So hopefully, fingers crossed, this time it, it works perfectly. Sometimes you just download a game and it just stuffs up. You ever had that experience, Campbell, where you download a game and it just stuffs up all the time, and then you delete it, download it again, it runs better? As I said, it happened to be once before with a Game Pass game. Not really, he says. I only happened once with a Game Pass game. Like I said, it, it just didn't work at all. Just didn't work at all. And so I um, just deleted it and downloaded it again. It worked perfectly. And that's the only ever time. But this is the first time I've played a game where it's just constantly frozen over and over again. The other game just didn't work. This one's just all over the place. So fingers crossed it's going to work perfectly now. Excuse me. Oh, we'll skip all this. Let's just get... Oh. I, I can't believe it didn't even save. That's what bummed me right out, guys. I'm sh No. Well... I hope you have a safe trip. Okay, so let's... <laughs> I'm kind of nervous it's going to happen again. I do apologize for doing all this crap again. To whom it may concern. Back okay, let me know when it comes up, cowboy. And find my life's work. A means with no end. A fruitless garden. Thirty years of questions with no answers. Be right back, guys. Much like my own hollow ambitions, some things never come to fruition. I only hope that these tattered pages may serve to prove that we are more than ourselves, and that our perception of reality is merely a veil over our own ideals and hunger to understand this world. I have many regrets. The Institute is not one of them. Okay, back. Sorry, guys. I had to get a drink. I'm dying. Uh, okay, I refreshed it. It's working for me now. Uh, Joker says it's working for me. Good, good to hear. Let's get out of this. Uh, what was the glove box we had to get? Just had to grab some stuff, I think, and then just hopefully it works without crashing seven times. Or we can crashing once. Freezing up, crashing. I don't know what you want to call it, but it was just terrible. Absolute terrible. <laughs> Can't believe it. At least we know what we need to do. So we should be able to skip a lot of stuff. Hopefully. Don't know how to save the damn game. I'll report it to the, uh, the Rattlelicker Games tech. Wish he was in the stream right now. Normally he calls past when I'm streaming his games. Uh, but hopefully, if not, I've seen him a message telling him to watch it. It's just, it's just crazy how many times it froze. And hopefully they can patch it. But then again, it might just be that download. So if it hasn't froze now, um, maybe it was just a crappy download that I got. I don't know. These things happen, I guess. Modern technology, guys. Gone are the days where you stuck the game in. What was that? Where you just stuck the game in the old Nintendo 64 or Super Nintendo or NES and just went about your game. Nothing. No updates, nothing. You just played the game and enjoyed it. Gone are those beautiful days. Now it's just a headache. Play a game. First time you get a game, you got to download a 50 gig Christ patch. Because <laughs> they couldn't get it right you to begin with. Gave me a heart. Okay, skipping stuff. Egg, so you don't sound like you're from around here. And even the, the, the testers don't even get it right, cowboy. Ten miles of trees and. I still can't think yeah, if he's, if he's wearing a hat. Let's... We have. I'm uh, headed east. Oh, I don't know. I think it's his hair. Oh, so do you want the good news or the bad news first? Uh, well, obviously I'm going to take the good news first. <laughs> well, your bad news is it's about half an hour back that way. 
hang about and I'll Try show you the way. Sure. Wasn't looking. <laughs> hey, okay, so at least we know what we need to, to do now. Road. The coffee part, it's been like five minutes of figuring out. Actually, I think it was Welcome more 10 minutes. To the last stop. No, we know what we're doing with the coffee. Okay, we know exactly what we need to do now, so. Oh, yeah, help yourself to coffee. I'll be done in five. So I never caught your name. Oh, it's Chris. Chris. Right. Nice and simple. Yeah. It was my dad's name. My grandfather, too. My parents weren't exactly ones to break tradition. Well, it's nice to meet you, Chris. I'm a neighbor. I used to know someone called a neighbor. It means winter, right? House. Winter is Pia. An era translates to snow. Oh, my Welsh is a little rusty. Hey, I'm impressed. Most English folk can't even read the road signs. Well, neither can I, apparently. So what brings you to this neck of the woods? I... Um, well, I buried my dad today. Oh, so walk shit. over to the uh, radio. I'm getting ready. I'm sorry. Oh, could you deal with okay, that? Come on. Yep, we'll do Just it. Just mess with the dial until it finds a signal again. I'm sorry. Thanks a while. That's oh, fine. We didn't uh, exactly see eye to there eye. We go. Yeah, my dad left when I was six. Turned up ten years later wanting to play Happy Family. I still get calls from him. Very interesting game, guys. Around, I've so. got very far into it thanks to those always freezing. Family crashes I had but I'll be finished up soon I, I'm really enjoying it my storyline the way it looks the way it plays apart from crashing as I said maybe it was just me not too sure and okay, now we're just gonna wait for the damn power to go off doesn't it wait till the power goes I'll just walk around hopefully that trigger the power off again and then um go under the breakers and Hopefully, <laughs> there we go. Again, yeah, the that's is the always second just like, time this week. I hate things like this. They drive me insane when they go wrong, cowboy. Hold on, i here somewhere. See, this is why I love smokers. You wouldn't mind taking a look, would you? Fuse boxes in the back. Uh, I do need to go on. Okay, I okay. guess. Last time I was. <laughs> so, okay, so, what am I looking for here? The kitchen. Right. Hey, Neira, a bunch of these fuses are fried. Should be some spares in there somewhere. Did my voice just get funny? And the fuse is dead. See? Dead. It sounded really weird. I just got it when he was yelling out, cowboy. When he's yelling dead. out, it, looked, it sounded different to his talking. It's, it's more deeper now. And then when he was yelling out to it, it sounded, you know, a little bit different. That's all. It did, trust me. Now we're gonna get a screwdriver. Where was that damn screwdriver? I think it was here, wasn't it? As usual, I'm hearing things. Thanks, cowboy. Appreciate it. Okay. Powering through it now. We know what we're doing. It's got to get to the fourth one. There we go. Hey, uh, no need to thank me or anything. A neighbor? Okay, so this is where it crashed. Oh, shit. Okay, so just like that, it's crashed again. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, that's... that's that's terrible. And I didn't save.
Oh man, I don't know how to save, to be honest. I thought it was auto save. Okay, so this thing just keeps crashing. It's terrible. I love the game, but it's terrible crashing. And on that note, guys, we have to end the stream right now because it's just no point to keep going on like this. Um, okay, so time to do Marvel A's mini indie game review on it. Um, Chasing Static brought to me today by the amazing people of Radalika Games, RadalikaGames.com. Check them out. Uh, due for release this coming Friday, the 13th of January, 2023. Hopefully, fingers crossed, they can get it fixed before they release it. Um, Story-wise, excellent. Old PlayStation 1 style horror games, even looks like it. Great story. Everything about it's really, really good. Visualization is excellent. I love the way it looks because it's old school. Um, yeah, it's everything about it's really, really good. Gameplay wise, it's what we could play of it is good. Controller wise, it's lower your sensitivity down so you control a little bit better. Everything worked good except for it damn froze every single time. It froze like five or six times on the first playthrough. I deleted the game, it reinstalled it while I was still streaming, and it, it, it froze again. It just keeps freezing, as you guys can tell. I oh, have no idea. I'm playing today on the Xbox Series X, and it just keeps freezing on me. This damn game, I'm really, really enjoying it. I really want to give it a high score, but I don't even think I can give it a score, to be honest, guys. To be honest, I, I don't want to give it a score. It's got potential to be like around an 8 or a 9, but I'm not even going to, I'm not even going to give it a score because I haven't even played as much. It, it, this, this is frustrating me too much, to be honest. So... Uh, the review, guys, my first time ever is not available. I can't review it. I can't give you a score. Not that you really care, to be honest. It's a great game. Just hopefully I can get this freezing thing fixed. Um, I'd like to thank everyone for calling past the stream today. If you like the stream, it's not my job, but I do apologize. And if you feel sorry for me, please drop me a follow on Twitch. I really do appreciate it. But if you're watching this back on my YouTube channel, I really, really do apologize for how this game's turned out with all the freezing. But... You can see his potential. You really can. And hopefully in the next two days before release, they can patch the crap out of it. Until then, guys. Wow. Wow. Uh, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. I really do appreciate you all. Big thank you if you can. It's the best way to uh, say thank you for streaming these games and all the other games. And come visit me over on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube. That's Marvel M-A-R-B-R-O-L-A-Y. Uh, until next time, guys. Uh, Take care of yourselves. Make sure you take care of yourselves ones love. Don't forget to feed your pets. And remember, guys, you're perfect just the way you are. Unless you want to change and change. Just be you, do you, and you'll be fine. Uh, this has been Rattle Licky Games Presents Chasing Static. Hopefully it gets fixed soon. Thank you for watching, and bye for now. Ta-da.